This was the last minute winning goal for Huntley Football Club over Nairn County on Wednesday evening. Shortly after the final whistle, it emerged that one of Huntley's players was racially abused by someone in the crowd. Nairn County have since released a statement condemning the incident. Investigations to find the culprit are ongoing. Just 72 hours later on Saturday, Huntley played their next league game here at Keith's Kinnock Park. The referee had to stop the match after racist abuse was allegedly hurled from the terracing. A seat there? Yeah, perfect. Yeah. Alan Hale is Huntley's manager. He says the past few days have been tough. I don't recall any instance of racial abuse or discrimination being known within the Highland League and, you know, the whole time I've been there. Um, we were very surprised when we were notified of the incident on, on Thursday following the, the game on the Wednesday evening um, and then disgusted when, you know, the incident reoccurred on, on Saturday. What's the reaction been from both players that have been involved in this? I'm sure it's mixed emotions. Um, you know, I'm sure they're disgusted at what's happened, um, you know, in the manner it's happened and, and how quickly the two incidents have happened. But I also know that they appreciate all the support, you know, from our club, from um, Nairn, from Keith and the Highland League community as a whole. Many colours, one team. That's the campaign Huntley are now running, determined to take a stand against racism. Police today say an 84-year-old man has been charged in connection with a reported hate crime here at Keith's Cannock Park. The club have since barred the individual concerned for life from the ground, a move welcomed by the Highland League. This is not one, this is not one for holding up your hands and saying, oh, God, what, what can we do about it? It's everywhere. This is one where good people have to stand up and be counted. It's as simple as that, and that's what we'll aim to promote over the next period. Words echoed by a leading charity focused on stamping racism out of the game. This is an opportunity to, to, to show leadership, to, to be brave, to have difficult conversations, but important conversations to call out family members and to expect more from one another. And if we all do that, we can move forward um, uh, considerably and, and try and put an end to, to incidents like this. Uh, which are just blighting the game. As teammates, we... For Huntley, one thing is clear. After two racist incidents in a matter of days, the priority is ensuring this never happens again. Brandon Cook, STV News.